A thyristor is a semiconductor device that can handle a large amount of electric power. This means it is possible to use thyristors for high voltage electrical circuits with large currents. Today, thyristors for high voltage circuits of 12 kilovolts are available on the market. Moreover, thyristors that can handle currents as large as 5000 amps are also available. The thyristor is also known as a semiconductor switching device. Unlike mechanical switches, thyristors have no moving parts and thereby enjoy a long useful life. Another feature is their fast switching speed. When pulse current is passed through the gate, the thyristor turns on. The on state is maintained once the thyristor is turned on. The current flows in the forward direction like a diode during the on state, but current does not flow in the reverse direction. To turn it off, it is necessary to reduce the current to zero, there are various ways of doing this, or by applying reverse voltage to the thyristor. Thyristors are chosen according to type of ship and application for which they will be used. Shaft power generators are widely used as devices that generate power by extracting partial power from the output shaft of the main diesel engine or steam turbines. In this shaft generating system, the frequency of the generating voltage remains unstable because the number of output shaft rotations varies according to ship speed. Thyristor inverters are used in shaft power generators to resolve this problem. When it comes to semiconductor products, including thyristors, it is important to guard against static electricity. Static electricity has a small amount of current, but the voltage can be several kilovolts or more. People are usually unaware that they have picked up electricity, making it possible for several kilovolts of static electricity to accumulate before they know it. Touching a semiconductor device in this state can cause the device to break down, a situation that can go unnoticed, since visibly it does not appear to have changed. To prevent electrostatic destruction, it is necessary to remove static electricity from the body prior to handling a semiconductor device or electronic circuit board. It is easy to rid yourself of static electricity. One simple method is to touch a tap with your bare hand. When on board ship, you can touch the steel deck floor, or ship side for several seconds with your bare hand. However, touching an FRP wall surface or glass can actually build up static electricity. <laughs>